Austin hit us up, and this one, mm, mm -mm. Colin, I, I know that you're going to cut this for individual use, so, so this is your end point here. Austin, I love you, and I really appreciate that you are contributing to the show in a meaningful, positive way, and that's where the pleasantries end. So just know what I'm about to do is not personal, but I'm going to have to eviscerate you here. He said, with the Cotton Bowl in the rough side of town, Dealing with traffic for the fair and declining stadium experience, should the Red River shootout be moved to Jerry World? OU Texas. Austin saying, do we take it out of the Cotton Bowl and do we move it over out into just that great patch of nothingness that AT&T Stadium is parked in? He continues, I feel like I know what your answer is going to be. But even I have come around to the idea of moving it. Well, that's a character flaw, Austin. It's not too late to fix yourself. We all have flaws about ourselves. One of yours is you think the Red River Shootout should exist anywhere other than the Cotton Bowl. The world is too sanitized now. I don't know how else to say it. The, 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 the college football world has attempted to sanitize itself a little bit too much. The Cotton Bowl should never be sanitized. OU Texas should never be sanitized. You, you ought to suffer going to this game. You ought to have back pain for a week afterwards after having to sit on a metal bleacher for four hours. You should not be able to dress like you're going to the Kentucky Derby and feel comfortable at this game. You would in Jerry World. That right there, we're rolling B-roll in the studio. That is where that game belongs. It's the best experience I've had covering this sport. Two years ago, I got to go to this game for the first time. And as I've told you guys before, full disclosure, I thought they were overhyping the game. All those years I lived in the South, I thought the Iron Bowl was it. I thought Georgia, Florida was it. And I thought that those folks out in the Big 12 were hyping that game up just a little bit too much. And then I went to it and I was wrong. Austin, just like you are now, I was wrong. And I have apologized profusely. Not only that, I call it the best experience I have ever been a part of in college football. The 50-50 crowd split, uh, back and forth scoring. It helped that we had a, a, just a firework explosion of a game. I walked out of the stadium and went and ate funnel cake at halftime. You're not doing that. You're not walking out of AT&T Stadium and going anywhere close because there is nothing close. You've got air conditioning every other day of the year. You don't need it. Okay, men have survived far worse than sitting out in the Texas sun for four hours. I want 65 year old guys in saggy, sweat drenched V neck t shirts. No one cares what they look like. No one cares that the bathrooms may be a little decrepit and there's the trough instead of the individual urinal. That's a beautiful thing. That's what it's supposed to look like. And I would encourage you, Austin, I don't know if you've been to this game or not. But I've been to the OU Texas game at the Cotton Bowl. I've been to several big games at AT&T Stadium. It's an immaculate venue. If I was playing a concert, I'd prefer it to be there. If I was holding WrestleMania, I would prefer it to be there. But we're not. We are not pro wrestling promoters or concert promoters. I am trying to actively promote, dare I say salvage, the greatest parts of the greatest sport on this planet. And one of the greatest things when it comes to that game, is the ambiance. I, the Cowboys play in that stadium. I don't care where they play. But when OU and Texas play, there is a lot about where that game is parked that contributes to the pageantry and ambiance and tradition of what makes the game great, why I ever heard about it to begin with. So it, it just disappoints me. I'm not mad at you, Austin. I'm just a little disappointed. Atmosphere matters. Authenticity matters. And I don't get that over at a sanitized, climate-controlled venue, which I've already got to watch in the playoffs and national title game and however far you guys are about to expand that postseason. Just please, can we cling to one or two bits of tradition about this sport instead of overhauling everything? Get off my lawn, Austin. I'm messing with you. I love you. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't leave yet. Don't leave yet. Make sure you like the video and please subscribe to the channel. Not just for me, that's how we keep this entire thing free.